Hey y'all, it's Kelsey. So for today, I thought I would give y'all a little tour of my dorm. I know whenever I was getting ready to come to college, I was all about looking up uh, dorm ideas, decorations, um, tours, and stuff like that. So here's my dorm. Okay, so a little background about the building. It's a new building this year, so we're the first group to live in it. So our dorm is suite style. We have four people that live here. There's, and we each have our own bedroom. It'll be two on one side, two on the other, and we, uh, both sides have a bathroom, so there's two bathrooms total. So we first walk in, there's a little kitchenette that's on the right, it has a sink. Um, one of my roommates brought shelving so we could keep all of our stuff on it and not in our rooms. Um, there's also space underneath for storage, trash can, um, refrigerator, stuff like that. But we actually keep our refrigerators over here because it just fits better in the room. So this is mine. I have a microwave and refrigerator and then a roommate's. We have our futon so you can just hang out. Okay. So on this side there are two bedrooms and I'm not gonna go in them because they're my roommates. And there's also a bathroom over there. Okay. And then this is my side of the dorm. So there's two bedrooms, there's one there, and then that's mine over there. Okay. So this is our bathroom area. Hello. And then in there we have a shower and toilet. Nothing very interesting. And then this is my room. So on my door I have all my door decks from previous years that my RAs made. First walk in, I have a mirror, and then I have some stuff on the floor. I keep my ukulele there, some shoes, um, whatever really ends up there. Then here is my bed. So I actually had this bedding last year too in my freshman dorm. And then I keep stuff hanging on the side. Oh, and I also have a fan because I like to keep it cold in my room, but. My roommates don't necessarily like that. Okay, and over here we have my closet. Um, I don't exactly have enough room for all my stuff, so you can see I have sweater stack up there, laundry detergent, and over here are my shoes. I usually also have my laundry basket over here, but um, it's in the laundry room right now. And then I always keep um, command hooks and stuff handy so I put one on the back of my door to hang jackets on because I just didn't have space in my closet to hang them and also it's just easier to grab it off of a hook when you're heading out the door and stuff like that okay I also have one of these nice um, storage shelves you can buy them at Ikea Target Walmart they're pretty popular so I use them for food storage as you can see um, keep my books um, cleaning supplies, just pretty much anything that doesn't really have a spot to go. It goes in one of these buckets. And I also have my Keurig in here, some Texas decorations, and then my jewelry stand. And then over on this side is where my desk is. You can see my microbiology book up there. So I usually keep uh, school stuff in here. So the bottom drawer has some more like binders and books. Um, not really sure what the middle drawer has. And then on top is just kind of collecting things. Like I have some water bottles up here, uh, a little letter holder for mail and anything else that is flat and doesn't really have a place to go. Okay. So when you come to college, you're gonna wanna. Um, personalize your room. So I have lots of decorations. Most of these are gifts. I have some sorority stuff, some more gifts. And then on this wall I hung up um, pictures of my family, friends, my dog. You can also see I put up some Christmas lights. I usually use those at night so I don't have to have the big overhead light on. And on this wall, just a few more decorations. Okay, so 
and give one last panoramic of the room. Closet. Desk area. Storage and bed. I also use that underneath in my bed for more storage. So there's this, you can see my suitcase underneath there, a bucket, just um, things I don't usually use on a daily basis will go over there. Okay, another thing about my dorm is that we have uh, study areas on each floor and a living room on each floor that has TV that anyone in the building can use. Um, usually it's just our floor that uses the one up here. So when you first get off the elevators, there's a nice seating area at a big TV that you can go out and watch. And then a little bit further down the hall, there's a study area. Uh, the study area can be used for um, group studies if you just wanna get away from your room. I know I use it because I get distracted in my room, so I'll go out there when I really need to get something done. And then downstairs, we actually have a kitchen that anyone in our building or the building next to us can use. So if I wanted to cook a meal, I could just go down there, um, check out some kitchen equipment, and cook it. In our building, we also have a dining hall. So I have a meal plan, so I go there to eat. Um, I get 10 meals a week, so I can just go in, swipe my car, I can stay in there as long as I want, eat as much as I want, and leave when I'm done. Okay y'all, I hope this room tour helped you out whether you're coming to college soon or just wondering what dorm life is like or looking for dorm decorations. If you like the video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos like this.